For the second time this week, a story about an outrageous Con Edison bill, this time a grandmother on Staten Island, getting a Con Ed bill for $5,000 for a piece of equipment she doesn't own and wants no part of. A big mistake by a big company. So what's going on? Here's Iowa News reporter Tim Fleischer. It came in Maria Sprizzo's mail, the first one about a year and a half ago. I opened this bill over $5,000, <laughs> you know, in, in billing, and I said, oh my God. Two Con Edison bills. She didn't know what to make of it. One showed my name and my address. The other one just had the address. The second Con Edison bill was strangely addressed to Charter Communications, Durant Avenue Pole in Staten Island. She wrote on the bill to the utility. You are writing to a wooden pole, and I send it back to them. For the record, Maria doesn't believe in opening someone else's mail. I did what I could, uh, and I called, and I tried. And the answer was, throw them out if you don't want them. The pole, Con Edison officials tell eyewitness news, is right out at the curb. Up there, right next to the charter communications box, is a Con Edison meter. Just why the bills for that meter were coming to Maria, in a statement, a company official says it did not involve occupant of home and we are sorry for confusion. She showed me some of the bills she'd saved over the last year and a half. Despite calling and writing, the mystery bills kept showing up in her mail month after month. The last thing this grandmother needed to deal with. Should I open them? Shouldn't I open them? And, and, and why, why? They're sending it to, they are sending it to a poll. At one point, Con Edison threatened to cut off service if the second bill wasn't paid. She even contacted the State Public Service Commission. We have forwarded your concerns to senior staff at the company. Never heard from them. Hearing about Maria's predicament, we contacted Con Edison, and officials went on to say the matter has been resolved. So come next month, Maria will find out if they finally found the right address for this poll.